starts first and foremost, welcome back to Walshot Town. How does it feel to have signed? Uh, fantastic, um, to be honest. Yeah, it was. It's always great to sign for a new football club, especially one that I'm slightly familiar with, um, with obviously a manager that, that I'm familiar with as well. Um, so it's an exciting time for me. Can you tell us a bit about you? Obviously, you've been here as a player when you were younger on loan, but you've been, you know, played in the League One, League Two, all sorts of different levels, and especially this level. So, how does that experience feel coming here and with the squad that Moles are trying to put together? Um, hopefully, I can, you know, add a lot of value. Obviously, the um, the early stages of my career, I spent a lot of time, obviously, with Bournemouth, and, and was part of that journey of them um, ultimately being promoted to the football to the to the Premier League. Um, Although I didn't, you know, play as much of a part and, and contribute as much as I possibly wanted to at my age. Um, and then, I, yeah, I spent a little while, obviously, floating between this level and, and League One and, and, and spent some time, obviously, in, uh, with Bristol Rovers. And that, that was fantastic. Um, and more recently, I've obviously spent a lot of time in the National League. So hopefully that, you know, those, those 12, 13 years that I've spent in professional football can can serve me well moving forward uh, and can also have a positive impact on, on this football club. You touched on Bournemouth as well, that's obviously where you met the manager here in Mark. How, what's he been like with you since signing? Uh, since signing, uh, only a couple of minutes ago, yeah, he's been great, but he, um, you know, we've, we've been in contact for, for a little while. Um, I speak to him every time that I see him and, and the team I play for obviously plays against him. Um, I, want him to, I want him to be successful, you know, he's, he's, he's a great guy, he was a good, great friend to me. Um, incredible role model when I was young and to now obviously be, be given the opportunity to to repay that impact that he had on my life with, with positive football results um, that will ultimately make him successful is, is something that I'm really excited to do. You personally, obviously, you're coming back to the club that you've been at before. You're playing in maybe a position that you feel more comfortable in, playing centrally, hoping to dictate play there. How do you feel with that in mind? I'm super excited, you know. It's... Um, I've been able to, luckily, I've been able to play different positions sort of my whole career. Um, I'm lucky with, with the upbringing that I had because of that. I'm, I'm able to, to sort of understand different roles. Um, and, yeah, that, that's what the manager wants me to do. He's, he, he has a, a certain way of playing and his sort of, his way of, of playing football aligns with, with how I feel that it should be played. Um, and, and like I say, yeah, it's, it's going to be exciting. Um, we're going to have, uh, you know, a lot of good players and hopefully we can we can all come together to be successful. With the way you, age you are now, rather, you know, the lads that he's looking to bring in, you're going to be one of the leaders. How important is that experience you've got with these lads that are going to come in? Quite important. Yeah, I, I totally understand that and, and, and I sort of totally understand the role that I'm going to play at sort of at my age and with the experience that I've got. But, you know, I, I don't think, I don't see that as, as being something that I think about daily. Um, I'm hoping to, you know, to have a, a positive impact on, on everybody around me. And um, But these young guys are, are in good hands with the manager that, you know, the, the training environment day to day is, is going to help them really progress. Um, and if I can obviously help contribute to that um, in any way, then, then that's a positive for everyone. You touched on the training environment and, you know, you said that's a massive thing upstairs, being keeping fit. How are you ahead of the new season? Yeah, I'm fit, you know, fit, feel fit, lean. Um, ready to roll in the off season. I actually quite enjoy going out for for a run and stuff, and doing that sort of self training and, and all that sort of stuff. It's it's an important part of the game now that, that everybody does. Um, and if you don't, obviously it's it will click, quickly find you out. Um, but I mean the training environment here that I know that the manager will, will you know will put on everyone is um, is honestly is is pretty impressive. His um, his training sessions are uh, are really intense. Um, and hopefully, obviously, as players, we can all buy into that and, and, and that can reflect the, on how we perform on a match day. Um, I know that supporters, obviously, must not have had much to, to cheer about and to be happy about last season. But, you know, I can assure you that, um, the, you know, there'll be no stone left unturned this pre-season for us to, to start the season well and, and to then obviously progress from there. What's your memory of the season? Obviously, the fact, sorry, the supporters here. Obviously, you're here for a brief time on loan, but what do you remember of your time here? I mean, it's a well-supported football club, isn't it? There's, there's that section, obviously, in the stadium behind the goal that's, that's always very loud. Um, and coming here as an away player, it's, it's you know, the pitch is, is something that's always quite memorable here and, and that's something that I'm looking forward to, to experiencing, um, obviously, more often. Um, and it's an intimidating environment to come, you know, the, the supporters make a lot of noise, they, they, they really do get behind the football club. Um, and sort of my memory of it uh, during that time was, was we, were, we were doing okay. Um, I obviously wasn't here for long, but it's, you know, I'm excited to, to hopefully, I know that I've heard the manager in interviews talk about 
how we wanted the fans and the and the team to to become more connected, and that's something that I'm excited to be a part of. You mentioned coming here as a way player. You've had success in there last season. Talk about the FA Trophy, your wonderful free kick that knocked Oldershot out, but also Bromley went on to win that. How important is obviously that sort of piece to your game and also success in a, as a whole at this level? Quite important, I guess. Maybe for for my CV, I, I'd argue that like. That of, yeah, the, I mean the free kick was nice, and it's and it's and it's obviously nice that people know that I'm capable of doing that. Um, and winning that trophy was, you know, I spoke about it sort of during and, and before the final. Is is as a player certainly at this level, your opportunity to actually win anything. This is very difficult to win the league at this level. To win anything is is pretty scarce to be honest. So so that trophy win for me. You know, I've been involved in successful teams and, and never really felt like I'd been enough of a part of it to to say I did that. Um, but, you know, that, that, that trophy sort of run last season and um, and us ending up, or probably ending up winning it, um, was something that, you know, I'll, I'll be able to, to... It will live long in my memory. And just finally, what are your goals and targets for next season? My goals and targets? Good question. Um, uh, I'm unsure... I mean, I want us to be as successful as we possibly can. I think that it's quite nice, maybe, that, that there's no real pressure on nobody's going to expect Aldershot to, to be this successful team that everybody's going to come to and, and, and find it difficult to play against off the back of last season. Um, but I think that's what we'll be. So um, I'm excited to, to start pre-season and start to you know, meet, meet the rest of the lads to get in that training environment every day um, and to progress with, with, with the other players and to hopefully be part of a team that people that support this football club can be proud of um, and they get positive results on a match day.